Hey guys, hope all of you are doing great. Today I'm gonna show you how to update a bathymetry file with recently um, surveyed bathymetry data. Uh, let's say this is our domain uh, of model and uh, and we have XYZ file already of this domain. First you have to load the data uh, by which uh, ultimately you will um, interpolate uh, the XYZ file and uh, make a mesh file or bathymetry file. Uh, these are two XYZ files. The first one is bathymetric data, August 2022. This is my uh, updated uh, bathymetry in some places where I want to update. And, and this one, my previous bathymetry data, which cover all the uh, domain or all the meshes in the domain so at first I load the first one then load the second one uh, just we are seeing here we closed space transit here in this site and this site and I want to update uh, this data the second one and uh, do that you have to at first uh, draw a polygon where you have to update i have already drawn a and polygon see there is a polygon one and here i am showing you on the polygon two one ready you have to draw the polygon where you want to update <coughs> i have already drawn this uh, so you can draw uh, using this tool define area S see this is another uh, prioritization area 3 it is called close okay my another area is created so that's how i have uh, uh, actually created uh, those polygons <laughs> prioritization area 1 and this one is 2 so it is my extra polygon let's delete this to delete this uh, Select delete area node. So it has been deleted. So now it's time to update the bathymetry. So let's see how to do it. Click on mesh and then interpolate. See, the you have to check mark on this box use prioritization mm, you can configure see here is prioritization area 1 and prioritization area 2 so under prioritization area 1 uh, the bathymetry data will be picked up from this file the, comp uh, the total uh, weight is is one here because uh, the value will not be taken from the previous bathymetry in area one, area one. Uh, at the same time in area two uh, the, the bathymetry data or xyz file will be taken from this file not from the previous one on, on the other places uh, in the domain uh, the bathymetry file will be taken from the previous one hmm. so if uh, you just now click on ok it will start uh, click on start and it will start interpolating and and uh, interpolated mesh file will be created it's uh, interpolating close so now if you just mesh click on mesh and uh, export mesh so export as mesh file
update with my face save. Actually, automatic interpolated file already created, uh, so or you can export like this. Okay, so let's open the mesh file. See, it is my mesh file for the 2D model. So in this portion. Uh, the west side of this Kutubdi Island. It is Kutubdi Island and it is Mathavari Island. The west side of Kutubdi Island and the west side of Mathavari Island has been, um, you know, updated. So uh, that's how actually we can update the bathymetry with new data. Thank you. Thanks for watching.